Hello everyone and welcome back. We are the Frobnicators and this is our round 2 entry for the Imagine Cup 2011 game design competition. I'm going to access the campaign section once again. Uh, I'm already running a match so I'll resume. Alright, so to begin with we have added animations. Um, the old shooting defenders has, have also suffered a facelift. Um, Catapults are the new defender vehicles that deal area of effect damage and one can use them as a tactical advantage when playing a map having certain choke points where area of effect damage is efficient. And note that all offensive structures now rank up automatically with no cost with respect to the number of vanquished germs. Supporting structures have suffered some changes too. The adrenaline pill now offers speed bonus and uh, the attack bonus is handled by the automated uh, ranking system. Um, also we have added a new structure uh, called the Aminolite which is responsible to apply buff, uh, buffs to adjacent towers and enhancing their range. Also we have implemented content wise a kind of achievement system, most importantly we have bound interesting information to it. Uh, by unlocking these achievements we are hoping to raise awareness to the player regarding different Attacks, different aspects of our viruses and other pathogens. To demonstrate, I'm going to try to actually gain one right now as I play. So I'll try to do the supporter achievement, uh, that is by constructing uh, five support towers um, during a mission. Right, so we already have four. I'm just going to have another pill placed here. There we are. So by clicking the achievement, we're presented the uh, the achievement screen, the cortex, as we've dubbed it. Uh, here we can see all the 12 current available achievements in Pulse, and by clicking each icon corresponding to the achievement, we can see the information unlocked um, by unlocking this specific achievement. Um, so much for content-wise. Uh, I think. Uh, we should uh, get going with another feature. Um, I'm going to log in a multiplayer game, right? So just abandon this mission, right? And I'm going to connect up to four players. I'm going to host a game. My colleague will join soon. Yes, here, here he is. Hey there. So as soon as he'll click ready button, I'll be able to click the start button, right? So <clears throat> there we go. Uh, another feature is um, this uh, map that has um, two waypoints. So we will actually have two spawning points for the mobs uh, that will go from the green dot towards the red dot, right? So um, this pretty much sums up um, multiplayer. Um, thank you for watching and I hope you've enjoyed the preview and see you again. Goodbye.